guys welcome to my channel today we are going to eat this japanese snack so we are going to test one by one and then i'll tell you what i like so if you guys have not yet subscribed please do subscribe and you can watch more of my japanese journey you guys gave me a good response on the japanese snacks today we are going to do japanese bread we are having two tests here we are having the savory test like this one here which i was eating already and then we have the sweet test like this melon bread so Renato from, I'm here with Renato from Lesotho how she look like will be this ginger drink so this is my drink for today so I'm going to give you an honest review of all this bread so we are going to start with this bread this one is a Japanese roll just so good You know the mm, that's so nice. So it came into a packaging which is and it was just 130 yen, so not that much of it. Okay, it looks yummy. It tastes divine. This bread, oh, give it from here to the, the edge. It tastes nice. Mm. Oh my god. Taste. How does it taste? Nice. And the next bread we are going to get is this meat loaf. This one is having grounded meat and egg. So nice. Look nice. I think you're on a budget side, but I've been eating this one. So again, let me just taste for you. Mm. Sweet test. This it smells like meat. But the bread is so soft and i love it have some sweetness in it and then meat taste but not so much of meat like in africa so it's different definitely not going to buy this one but uh, i think i love this noodle bread it look it doesn't look good but it tastes better so do you want to taste the bread so coming from the savory oh. test we are going to go to the sweet test then bread the packaging is so nice, it's so good. I think you can have it as a snack or as lunch. It can be shared so big and it's just 120 yen. Let me give you a test. Not so soft like the raw, but you just can eat it. Mmm, 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 mmm. It tastes very good. It tastes of butter. It tastes like our bread, but with butter and then a nice smell to it. I don't know what that will smell. Then they just sprinkle some sugar on top of it. So the next, we are going to have the French inspired bread. The these are the one we've been having. The packaging is perfect. It looks very nice. The presentation. So let me give you a test to tell you how does it taste. This is how it looks when it's out of the pack. It looks very presentable. And that's how it looks inside. Just made very warm. Very creamy. With a bit of salt. I think they, they sprinkle some salt on it. And then they just put sugar on top, but they don't cook with <coughs> sugar. We definitely buy this again. I'm making my mountain of bread here. Then we go to the next bread. This one is chocolate. Uh, but then the packaging is different. This one looks so much. They look so cheap. Right. Very cheap. They look cheap. Let me give you a test. Chocolate is really not my favorite um, flavor, but this is how it looks like. Oh, it doesn't smell good. Oh, it's not chocolatey. It's soft, but it doesn't bounce back. I think it's not fresh. The texture just looks like the other one. The smell. 
Smell like chocolate, but it tastes like a pie. No, I don't like that one. Let me go to my other least favorite flavor. This one is just a chocolate pie. The packaging looks very budget friendly. It's made out of wheat. And then on the price point, it's also cheap. Uh, it doesn't look <laughs> doesn't look well presented, but then it has some chocolate chips on top of it. Let me test. I'm not a fan of pie. This is how it looks like. I like it though, but it tastes like dough that not, was not cooked well in the oven and it just pickled some, some chocolate chips on top of it. Then we go to this one, this is a cheesy puff, they look so cute, now they too. also taste cute, they are also made out of wheat. Japanese, they eat a lot of wheat. They bounce back when you press them. <laughs> Not my type of test. This one I just cheese puff. They taste like fat cake from Africa. No, I don't know how you guys call it. It tastes like fat cake. Just with a lot of salt. No sugar in it. My tastes are sweet. No, else the tester should be soft. Then I like the bread. Then we go to their brown rolls. Nice covering. This is how it looks like. This one has 8 slices. And then... It's, their bread are made out of butter and milk, so it's very soft, like very soft. Then when you touch it, it bounces back. It's very fresh, so nice, small, divine. Let me give it a test. Bread is not my thing, but I think I'll start eating bread from Japan. This is doesn't it look very plain, but it is different. So the next um next bread, which are bread roll. Mini cream rolls. They, I love the packaging. They look so cute. Like one, two, three, four, five. Five mini rolls. I'm saving the best for the last. This is how they look. The packaging perfect. And they are so inviting. So soft. And fresh. Mmm. They're having custard swelling inside. Wow, I love this one. <coughs> Wait. <laughs> They're more like a pie that we ate at mm. KFC, you remember? It mm. has it has something like this this custard like taste. Mm. But this one tastes very nice. It's custard filled. <coughs> Let me just finish it. This tastes so tangy. They have a sweet and creamy taste and so soft. Then you just melt in your mouth. I'll buy this one as a cream. Just bread roll filled with cream. And it's not that very sweet, just a perfect combination of salt and sugar. That's what you get out of this bread. And then we go. We save the best for the last. So this is melon cream and melon sauce. I love the packaging. It's so inviting. And in Japan, what you hmm? what you what you see is what you get. And so let me give you a test for this. In the circle here, when they put it in their house.
very soft and delicate. It's hard to describe it at all. This is how it looks like. It looks too white. Hmm. I I love that it's sweet. I love how it smells. It smells like melon. The bread is not soft and the cream is less. That's how it looks like. I feel like the bread look undercooked. So, not... so which one are my favorite bread so far? Definitely love this mini roll. And then the, the bread. And then I love the melon pan. But I don't love the melon cream bread. And my least favorite that I will not even buy. Never going to buy this cream puff, and I'm never going to buy this chocolate bread. Um, but this one, my favorite. I hope you guys enjoyed the video, and please subscribe, like the video, and comment on what you think about this bread roll especially this one mm. thank you for watching bye how many minutes hey. it seems like it wasn't recording why did you, you make me talk all this time <laughs> no yeah it wasn't Martha. <laughs> sorry can i thought i, I pressed the, the red thing hmm? can i have my tent i'm sorry it's madam okay let me redo it again. I'm joking. Continue. Oh, okay. Ah. <laughs> you want what now? My thing. Oh. Okay. And you love bread rolls. I'm not from. Yes. Let me finish now. You guys started eating up all the bread. <laughs> no, okay. Smart. We got.